Now these are troubling times for Pakistan. The dynamics are off the track on both political and financial front. The economic crisis is in fact magnified by the political tensions at a time when the country is in a dire need of external financial support. Saudi Arabia is expected to extend aid to its allies. Last year, Saudi Arabia deposited a three billion dollar uh, package in Pakistan's central bank. The move was to help support Islamabad's foreign reserves. Now, Saudi Minister of Finance. was reported saying that the kingdom is finalizing the extension of the 3 billion dollar deposit to pakistan the minister was speaking on the sidelines of the world economic forum in davos saudi finance minister said that pakistan is an important ally and that the kingdom would stand behind the nation saudi minister did not offer further details on the same now this development comes after the new prime minister of pakistan shehbaz sharif had recently visited the kingdom The two countries had issued a joint statement in this regard. They had mentioned discussing the possibility of supporting the deposit by extending its term. Pakistan is likely headed for long-term instability while the current account deficit is widening. The foreign reserves are now falling below 10.5 billion dollars. This is equivalent to less than 2 months of imports. A fast crashing Pakistani rupee and a double digit inflation only add to the woes. In April inflation in Pakistan hit a 2 year high of 13.4%. This week the central bank hiked its interest rate for the second time in more than 2 years. The ongoing talks with the IMF over a seventh review they're likely to conclude in Doha. Remember the previous government was replaced after facing the blame for mishandling the economy but the new prime minister Shehbaz Sharif has also failed to announce any bold steps towards putting the economy back on track. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.